Hi, this is Dennis Prager, and this is what you missed yesterday on the show. I'm just curious. My position has been, in every one of these instances, that when a man, and it's always been a man, when a man has led as honorable a life as Brett Kavanaugh for 30, 40 years, I am not interested in what happened in high school or college. Obviously, we remove murder uh, and pretty much just murder, but or something heinous. I don't want to know. It doesn't tell me anything about this human being to go back that far. Do you agree? I don't care if you don't agree. It's a, I always tell guests it's okay to disagree with me. I'm just curious. I would remind you what Susan Collins says in our book where she says that she shared your viewpoint about that, but once he said it never happened, she felt that it actually did matter whether it happened or not. Because if he was claiming it didn't happen and it had, that would make him a liar and inappropriately placed on the court. Um, So I, I agree with you that it's absolutely ridiculous that people are going back to high school. In this case... Brett Kavanaugh didn't do these things in high school. There is no evidence. I know. I totally believe that. But even if he did, uh, uh, especially, the, you know, what what college kids do at a drunk party, this is now the criterion for measuring a man's character 30 years later, married, a pillar of his community, faithful to his wife, taking care of a family. Th- this This invalidates 30 years of such a life? Yes, it is ridiculous, and yet that is the new standard that seems to be applied to... Is it, appla- is it applied to Democrats? Democrats? If you're a Pragertopia member, you can listen to the complete segment along with every show every day and commercial-free. You'll never miss another show. Go to Pragertopia.com.